In a surprising move, South Korea's central bank has cut its benchmark rate after its July policy meeting today, citing external factors including Japan's recent export restrictions against South Korea. For more, we have our Kim Dami on the line for us at the Bank of Korea. Dami, what can you tell us? The Bank of Korea slashed its policy rate by 25 basis points to 1.5 percent to help spur growth amid prolonged trade tensions. This is the first rate cut since last November when the central bank raised the rate by 25 basis points to 1.75 percent. In fact, the last rate cut was three years ago, back in 2016, when the rate was at, at a record low of 1.25 percent amid slow economic growth. The BOK pointed to growing external uncertainties, including the U.S.-China trade dispute, as well as Japan's latest export restrictions on South Korea. The unexpected rate cut also comes after seven consecutive months of decline in the country's exports. Exports, a key driver of South Korea's economic growth, could face further headwinds due to Japan's latest export curves on key materials for the production of semiconductors and displaced panels. The BOK also pegged the country's GDP growth rate to 2 percent this year, lower than its April forecast of 2.5 percent due to the fall in outbound shipments and investments. The BOK governor also said Japan's export curves did influence the central bank's decision and added if Japan dials up economic pressure, it could have a measurable impact on Korea's economic growth. Now, Bank of Korea Governor Lee Ju-yeol had earlier hinted at a possible rate cut, but the timing of it came as a surprise to many market observers, right? Yes. Uh, many analysts had expected the move to happen in August, with the U.S. Federal Reserve expected to lower its own key rates at the end of this month. However, the central bank's latest decision sends out a strong message that an expansionary monetary policy is needed to boost the country's economic growth. Uh, the Bank of Korea said it will maintain its accommodated policy stance to support the domestic economy and carefully monitor the U.S.-China trade war as well as Japan's latest experts, ex, uh, expert curves. Excuse me. Uh, that's all from me, Ji-yoon.